and welcome to another episode of Alice in Simland. As we arrive today, Mad Hatter is bathing outdoors. Yep, that's a thing now. Okay, we've got some uh, white rabbit going to get a glass of milk in his swim trunks. Oh, okay, he's uh, he's eventually going to come inside, right? It's, is he, he's planning to talk to March. I'm not sure. That's scary. Okay, everybody had gotten back from the pool, and as usual people don't just snap back to normal so we do have people in swim attire oh that was quite a lightning strike wow scared poor white rabbit in the kitchen any chance it hit the house I mean it's possible right Okay, so how about we put real clothing on? That might be a thing. Mad Hatter has come inside, but has failed to put clothing back on his body. Huh. Oh, I hope nobody else uses that chair today. We've got a wedding to plan for these guys. I was thinking, though, it's been, it's been a hectic time. So we maybe will put together some... Uh, He's a snorer. Um, some clothes for these guys for the wedding. Some beautiful formal attire. And I was thinking that maybe I would take these guys camping. Um, possibly invite uh, Dormouse and Channing and Alana. Don't know how many people we can fit. Um, we can always pitch a tent if we need to outside of the house. So if we can go to Granite Falls, I think that might be a good idea. Except, gosh, it's raining hard. Um, that seems to be the thing, though, in all of our neighborhoods. Garden's looking pretty good. Happy plants. Happy gnomes. So, I don't know, let's go ahead and take Alice in and check out how, uh, how we can get her dressed up for the wedding. They were engaged a bit ago. I don't know if you missed it. It was a pretty sneaky, stealthy garden proposal. Mad Hatter, please, please put your clothes on. Oh, now he's going into Alice's bathroom. Okay. But she needs to go in there to do... Oh. Okay, with the push-ups.
He's looking good. What do you think? Again, you can't answer me. I like it. Okay, so we're going to stick with that. It's looking pretty awesome to me. It's the bride and the groom. I love it. There. We're going to go to Granite Falls and do a little camponating. Two beds, four beds. Okay, there's six of us. <laughs> one, one, two. Uh, we could go there and just have tents. Oh my god, how terrible would that be? Four and three. Hmm. That's going to have to be our pick. Although, what's going on here? Non-rental lots. Sure, whatever. How many days do we want to go? Uh, five days? Four days? Three days? Let's do three days. We really don't have that much time to spare. All right, we're here, and yes, there is an insane thunderstorm here as well. So let's figure out who's going to sleep where. Um, Alice and Marge can sleep together. Oh, geez. Um, who else can sleep together? Because we can, we can make this work if we can bunk up. And where does that leave us? So it's one, two, three, four, five downstairs. And hey, what is going on there? He's trying to play with a toy and he poked himself in the eye. What in the world? Why is the kitten here? Oh my gosh, no! I didn't mean for Dinah to come. Oh my god. Oh, that means Chessie's home all by himself. That makes me sad. We don't have food for her. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is terrible. We've got to fix this somehow. So what we did... Okay, you can go back where you were, honey. So, okay, so what we did was we took the cat home. <laughs> Both of the cats are at home. Alana stayed home. We went and got Channing, and we've returned. Apparently, they already had time to make s'mores. Is this our... Is this our um, our girl who's showing us around? What What's going on, honey? Rockets. What? Are you leaving? Bye. Do Should we talk to you? I guess we should probably be nice. Apparently, Alice had a s'more. I'm not sure when there was time for that. Illuminated by stars. Yes, we are. Oh, look what a nice shot that is. Of all the friends together, we're missing a couple. March Hare is feeling paranoid and having a burger alone. What's her name? Lenola. I'm having a little trouble with that. That's, that's like one of those names. Like Rory. Makes you do weird stuff with your mouth. Anyway. Okay, so if, um, she's the friendly forest ranger. You're not dressed like a forest ranger. Chock full of camping knowledge. We will not hesitate to ask you questions. We'll call her Miss T. Burn money. Uh, we can roast uh, marshmallows. Why are you being flirty with the ranger? Oh, he's playing horseshoes. How nice. Wow, that's it's really gross. Okay. Still playing horseshoes. Oh, Queen uh, reached fitness level two. What the heck is she doing? She's just sitting at the table. I'm not sure what happened previously. It's a nice little fireplace area. Can we light the fireplace even though it's really hot out? What are they listening to?
Okay, well, we lost track of Dormouse. You guys, come explore the butterflies! Blue Morpho. Mm -mm -mm. Walking stick. Okay, not as cool. Fire ants. I have a feeling something bad is going to happen when she comes over to view fire ants, but... Mantis. Oh yeah, that's right up March Hare's alley. You want to join us, Mad Hatter? He loves being by the fire. Cozy campfire. Oh! Striped eggplant frog? That is too cute! Hello! What is your name? Alright, he probably doesn't have a name. And I'm talking in a ridiculous voice. Let's call him Herman. He looks like a Herman, doesn't he? I think he does. check out the fire ants? You didn't get any on you, I hope. There's a mantis in this terrarium. Wow, March Hare doesn't miss a beat. Such, such adorable frogs. White Rabbit is paranoid. Are the bugs freaking you out? Oh, March Hare is playing the guitar? March here is trying, oh, okay, trying his hand at some, uh, guitar. Who knew he could be a musician? We'll leave him to it. <laughs> um, what else is going on, guys? Anything else exciting in this building? What's upstairs? Nothing. Um... Well, okay. It is never going to stop raining. We really could be doing so many more things. We could do this stuff at home. Oh, dear. I didn't tell her to do that exactly. I just told her to do a sexy pose. Oh, there it is. What? Okay, it's getting wild and crazy now. Ah, she's disgusted with them. She said yuck. Maybe you guys could have a little private time in your room. How's your, uh... Yes. Did you finish? Quit pimbo. Blue's wangle. Stone. Oh, there it is. Kazooie Looks really good. Freeman. Very nice. A flip. <laughs> good job. Flew. Beautiful sculpture. We can't put it back on the table. Whatever. Whatever Sims 4. Okay. <laughs> Why are you shaking hands? You live together. Hello, shall we be? Fuss. Ponka, yes. How come yips. you haven't talked to your girlfriend in a while? Are you guys even romantic anymore? Is there any connection left? Oh, there's Darlene. There's Leinani. No romance left. Such sadness. Tell her you're on vacation and you're thinking about her. Hey, Wimbo. Is it time to leave yet? Hey, Wes. What is that? Sparked by clouds. He's inspired. How lovely. Wow, that's a lot of mounted fish. The excitement is palpable. Let's go home. Well, to our cabin, guys. Can we do that? Our chairs always last. <laughs> the little wooden hearts on the front of the building. How adorable! It's a strange building, I gotta say. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Bring the food inside. And then call to meal. Maybe we can actually spend some time outdoors this evening. That would be crazy. Alright. 
You know what? We need to change it to our traditional jazz station, I think. Hmm. Much better. Oh good, he did reach guitar level 4. Some good tunes. And it started raining again. Oh, Alice and Queen are having a little... A ghost story about a mirror. Uh-oh, what just happened? I was over here trying to get everybody to the campfire. Umbrellas, maybe? Oh, the paranoia is so bad. He's out of here. He's not telling any ghost stories in the rain. There's just no way to get around this, is there? Well, we thought it would stop raining, but apparently not. Why is Dormouse so sad? And where the heck is Channing? Well, they're all out in the rain. Can we? We can't light the fire. We can still tell a ghost story while everybody's paranoid. Did Channing go home? I think maybe he did. Oh, they're going to bed. Forget the ghost story. No fire tonight. No horseshoes. Dinner and bed. Who's gonna clean up though? Anyone? Okay, so it is 10.30 the following morning, just about. Almost 10.30. And as you can see, from the puddles everywhere, there is torrential rain falling. You know what I'm saying? Some people slept in a little bit. Other people are doing push-ups again. Anyone want to clean that? March Hare's trying to read a book. He's thinking about Excalibur. Uh-oh. Trouble in Paradise? Oh, no, he didn't. They had an argument. Oh, boy, yeah. Nia now. He huh? bust out with his magic cue. I guess that means they're okay? Is that what we, uh... We're gonna rely on that device to determine our relationship? Is that what you're saying, Channing? Making some coffee. Well, that's about all the excitement we're gonna get out of this cabin. Because it's still pouring. It's not just raining hard, but it is also a thunderstorm, and the lightning strikes have been prevalent. I'm sorry that we didn't get to do anything, guys. Oh, they snuck off to the uh, living room. Gonna light a fire? Oh, maybe a different kind of fire? Okay. Queen is in her slippers and her pajamas. And oh, they need a little privacy back there. Mad Hatter has his robe on and he's doing some more push ups. You know what? I think that's about enough. Oh, White Rabbit had to come running in from the lightning. I mean, it is a really beautiful campground. Um, when it's not pouring out. Oh my goodness! There's one of them now! That was a big one. Okay, so... If, uh, if you could answer me, I would take a vote. Do we stay an extra night or not? Alright, the park ranger is out here fishing. Well, how about we try fishing? You know, for a real angler, the rain is not a deterrent. Let's do this. They look so completely out of place. They're all dressed up. 
<laughs> doing more push-ups in the mud this time. It is raining, lightning, thundering. We're fishing. We're going to get the most out of this vacation, darn it. Even if we all die from a lightning strike. More push-ups. Oh my gosh. You know, anybody that works on The Sims 4, any gurus listening, I doubt it. Because why would you watch my channel? But, if you're listening, fewer push-ups. Oh my god, he's... Why? Why are you laying down there? You're cloud gazing? Well, they're all full of rain. It's muddy though, Marge. I think that's a bad idea. I was going to have him do some stargazing. Oh my god, those are huge! She caught a walleye. Worth $21. Okay, well. Good job, dudes. Everybody else gave up. <laughs> what in the world? Matt just caught... A sage. Okay. I don't know. Before any of us get struck by lightning, I think it's probably time to end this episode. It is a really nice location. <laughs> Generally speaking. So, we're going to leave these guys alone. I think they've had just about enough. Queen, are you picking somebody up over there? He looks angry. Elias Neves? you introduce yourself? He likes cats. Oh, she hates them. You have nothing in common. He's a cat lover. Yeah, probably nothing will come of that. She always blows it in the end. Sorry, Queen. So with that, I'm going to wrap this one up. I hope that you've enjoyed this somewhat strange and extremely soggy episode of Alice in Timland. Please join us next time for another episode. Probably going to be the Alice and March hair wedding. Um, the fish are too crafty for Matt. Of course they are. Um, so join us then. It may or may not be as insane as uh, Dormouse's wedding. We will try to avoid the wedding singer though. Until next time, I hope you're happy, safe, and healthy, and that you have a beautiful day.